Here we are, five o'clock on a Friday afternoon. It's a beautiful Friday afternoon here in Vero Beach, Florida. And as you can see, the Riverside tennis courts are completely deserted, um, which is just what a lost opportunity. Where's the programming? Where is somebody in charge getting people out here and playing tennis? Tennis is one of the most healthy activities that you can participate in in Vero Beach. This is one of the great tennis towns in the country and there's nobody here and you know to add insult to injury you have uh just not really a lot of care taken to windscreens that are loose and flapping and and ripped and hey let's just throw that over the top of the fence you know there's just no care here people want to play sports in places that are nice it makes them feel good if it's if it looks nice if it feels nice etc but you know, if, if, if people can't take good care of the environment of where, you know, they're hosting recreational activities, why should people care about playing them? And the, the people that are presenting something like this, it's just, it's just not a good look. It's not a good look for Vero Beach. This is, Riverside Park is a beautiful place. And this, unfortunately, is an eyesore in one of the most beautiful parts of our beautiful town here at Vero Beach. Hi, Saturday, March 26th, Riverside Park Tennis Courts. Uh, I shot a video, uh, gosh, a week or so ago about the um, windscreens here that aren't put up. And it's still another week and the windscreens are still down. It just looks terrible, terrible. I mean, it's, it's a beautiful park and it just looks like a slum. You know, just nobody taking care or have any pride in how this place looks. We really need to have more care and more attention to the tennis courts here in Vero Beach at Riverside Park. Randy Walker here at Riverside Park, uh, Vero Beach, Florida. It's April 1st and it is no April Fool's joke. The windscreens are still down and sloppy, just looks trashy, eyesore here in Riverside Park. Let's fix this, please. No April Fool's joke. There it is, once again, windscreens down. Hi, Randy Walker. April 4th, 6.30 p.m., Riverside Park. The tennis windscreens are still down. When is somebody going to take care and make this place look as beautiful as it deserves to be? There's just no care, nobody cares that this place looks like a dump. Hey, Randy Walker here, Riverside Park, April 12th. We have the uh, high school championships uh, being played here. And uh, again, when, there are new windscreens up, but the old ones are just lying on the ground. So we have uh, people from all over the state coming here to our town, Vero Beach, Florida. And this is the impression that they get, is that there's old, ratty, windscreens lying on the ground not a very good advertisement for Vero Beach okay Tuesday April 12th here at Riverside Park Tennis we have teams from all over the state competing in a state high school tennis tournament and look at the windscreens what a terrible impression people have of Vero Beach here that they're playing in this beautiful town and this is the condition that the tennis courts are in. Where's the care? Where's the pride in this facility where you have a big event where you're showing off our city and this is the impression that is projected to people from all over the state. Just a terrible, terrible look. We need better care, better attention to this beautiful tennis facility that has so much potential but just is neglected hey randy walker here it is wednesday april 13th and i'm at riverside park the tennis complex we've got a big state high school tennis championship going on and once again here it is the second day of the tournament and those windscreens are still down i mean where's the pride here there's no civic pride i mean put up the damn windscreens like Who's in charge here? What's going on here? Does anybody give a crap about how this place looks and what kind of uh, impression that gives on Vero Beach? We have people coming in from all over the state and uh, this place looks like a dump. Come on, let's, uh, we need a little upgrade here at Riverside Park Tennis.